Hello everybody and welcome back to Surf Fact Collectibles. This is another episode of First Appearance of the Week. This is Wednesday, June 14th, 2023. We'll be giving you all the first appearance in your comic shops today. Now this week we have a pretty good video for you guys. I think we have five first appearances, five honorable mentions, so ten titles on all to go through. Definitely some books in there you guys should pick up for your collection. So let's go ahead and get started for the first appearance of the week, weekending June 16th, 2023. First up from DC Comics, Batman Incorporated number 9. This features the first full appearance of Charles de Gaulle, a member of Joker Incorporated. Now this Batman Incorporated title series has definitely had a lot of first appearances. This is not one of DC's stronger tentpole series, this is more of a B series or subset series for DC Comics. So the fact that they're introducing characters in this particular title series, they're going to have to do something much more important with these characters to give them more relevance in the future. They can introduce them into a small screen, big screen project, bring them across other story arcs, other story titles, or other title series, and that'll get a lot more eyes on these characters, give them a lot more relevance in the future. Like I always say with the DC Comics, it really depends on how they treat these new characters they're introducing. If they really do get a lot more eyes on these characters, make these characters popular, these are definitely books you want to own for the future. But if they don't, you know, these characters could really just die in these title series. They could go nowhere. So this one here is definitely going to be speculative going forward, but it might be worth picking up for the cover price. Like we always say, you don't want to chase these down later on for a lot more money. And this does feature the first full appearance of this new Charles de Gaulle character. So this one here is definitely a spec bet if you choose to pick it up. Grab it if you can. If you can't, though, put on your B-list and take a look at it later on. Next up from Marvel Comics, Black Panther number 1. This features the first appearance of Bisa, a thief. Now this is the premiere issue of this new Black Panther title series from Marvel Comics, and this does feature the first appearance of this new character. You know, Black Panther, this franchise, hugely popular, huge fan base, huge collector base, and the fact they're introducing a new character into this premiere issue of Black Panther, this is one you definitely want to pick up and add to your collection. Go ahead and grab this one. Next up from Marvel Comics, Doctor Strange number 4. This features a possible first appearance of a supernatural serial killer who destroys magic by eating it. Now, since this is a possible first appearance, you definitely want to do a little bit more research on this before you choose to pick it up. If it is indeed the first appearance, if this is confirmed, this is one you probably want to add to your collection. Now, we say this with all the Marvel Disney titles. It's always worth picking up the first appearance of new characters in Marvel titles. You know, Marvel Disney is still going very strong with all their content, whether small screen or big screen. And you really don't know where any of these characters they're introducing in the comics are going to appear. So like I mentioned, do a little bit more research on this. If this is the true first appearance of this new serial killer, then this is one you definitely want to pick up and add to your collection. Next up from Marvel Comics, Extreme Venomverse number 3. This features the first appearance of Madame Venom. This also features the first appearance of Black Fang, a prehistoric version of Venom, and the reintroduction of Venom Space Knight. Now, I mentioned this before with the Venom franchise. This is a huge franchise, huge fan base, huge collector base. So the introduction of new characters, these are books you definitely want to own. And this particular issue here has two first appearances and a reintroduction of a Venom Space Knight. This is a book you definitely want to pick up and add to your collection. Go ahead and grab this one. And finally from Marvel Comics, Marvel's Voices Pride number one. This features the first appearance of Muzzle, a symbiote. Also the first appearance of Nightshade. Now we mentioned this with all these Marvel Disney titles. It's probably worth picking up the first appearance of new characters in Marvel titles, no matter what the title, just because you really don't know what Marvel Disney have planned for these characters in the future. You know, if any of these characters appear on the small screen big screen project here in a few years, people are definitely going to race back and try to find the first appearance in comics. This one here will be a little bit more speculative than some of the other titles we mentioned, but like I said, it's probably worth picking this up for two or three bucks and then try to chase them down years later for hundreds or thousands of dollars. So this is another one we think you should definitely pick up for your collection. And now for the honorable mentions. From Image Comics, Void Rivals number one. This is the introduction of the Intergon universe. Two famously established properties now published by Image, existing in a shared universe and written by Robert Kirkman, The Walking Dead. Now this is one we do think you should pick up and add to your collection. This will definitely be speculative, but this is written by Robert Kirkman. You know, he has huge success with The Walking Dead. So anytime his name is attached to something, it does give a little bit more potential for this being optioned in the future for a small screen, big screen project. So this is one we do think you should pick up. Like I said, it will be speculative, but in our opinion, well worth the risk. Grab this one here if you can. If you can't though, put it in your B-list and keep an eye on it. Next up from Titan, Dead by Daylight number one. Now this is a four issue prequel series based on the video game. This also includes a code to unlock an in-game charm. Now we mentioned this before within these video game based comics. These are definitely lightly sold, lightly distributed, and lightly collected when they first come out, which gives them a lot of potential in the future for high gains. A lot of people don't pick up these video game inspired comics when they hit the shelf, and so the people that do are definitely rewarded for it later on. In our opinion, these video game comics are always worth picking up. So this one here will be a little bit more speculative, but in our opinion, well worth the two or three dollar cover price. Grab this one here if you can. If you can't though, put it in your B-list and keep an eye on it. Next up from Image Comics, Haunt You to the End number one. 
An eccentric billionaire assembles a crew to prove the existence of life after death. Now this one here sounds like it can lend itself very well to a small screen or big screen project, and Image Comics has had a lot of their titles picked up an option in the past. Like we always mention, that is a huge price driver for these comics. If they do get option and do make it to the screen, people race back and try to find these first appearances or these premier issues of these particular title series. So this one here, we do think is worth picking up. This will be speculative. You're definitely specking on this being option and going somewhere in the future. But for two or three bucks and this goes huge, you're sitting on a winner. If it goes nowhere, you're out two or three dollars. Once again, in our opinion, the reward is worth the risk. Grab this one here if you can. If you can't, though, put it on your B list and keep an eye on it. Next up from Image Comics, click, click, boom, number one. A mute assassin raised by her doomsday prepping grandfather heads to New York City to avenge his death. Now once again, this sounds like it lends itself very well to a small screen, big screen project. And Image Comics has had a lot of their titles picked up an option in the past. So once again, this will be a little bit more speculative. But these Image Comics, in our opinion, is always worth the risk. You're risking three or four bucks to be sitting on a winner. So grab this one here if you can. If you can't though, put it on your B list, but keep an eye on this one. And finally, from Scout Comics, Omega Gang number one. A group of Gen Z teens discover a set of mysterious eggs, but are unprepared for what comes out when they hatch. Now, Scout Comics is another one that's had a lot of their titles picked up an option in the past. And you know, Scout Comics are not necessarily as highly distributed or collected when they come out. So the collectors that actually do pick these up off the shelf are definitely rewarded handsomely later on. So once again, this will be a little more speculative, but in our opinion, it's always worth picking up these Scout titles. Three or four bucks, you could be sitting on a winner. So grab this one here if you can for a spec bet. If you can't, though, put it in your B list, but definitely keep an eye on it. So there you have the 10 titles that we have for you guys this week. Definitely some books in there worth picking up for your collection. So please feel free to drop some comments in the comment section below. Thumbs up if you like this video. And as always, please remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you for joining us here at Certified Collectibles, and we'll see you again next time.